The Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II is an American family of single-seat, single-engine, all-weather stealth multirole combat aircraft that is intended to perform both air superiority and strike missions. It is also able to provide electronic warfare and intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities. Lockheed Martin is the prime F-35 contractor, with principal partners Northrop Grumman and BAE Systems. The aircraft has three main variants, the conventional takeoff and landing, CTOL, F-35A, the short takeoff and vertical landing, Stovall, F-35B, and the carrier-based, cv catabar F-35C. The aircraft descends from the Lockheed Martin the 10th-35, which in 2001 beat the Boeing X-32 to win the Joint Strike Fighter, JSF, program. Its development is principally funded by the United States, with additional funding from program partner countries from NATO and CLOSU. S. Allies, including the United Kingdom, Australia, Canada, Italy, Norway, Denmark, the Netherlands, and formerly Turkey. Several other countries have ordered, or are considering ordering, the aircraft. The program has drawn much scrutiny and criticism for its unprecedented size, complexity, ballooning costs, and much delayed deliveries, with numerous technical flaws still being corrected. The acquisition strategy of concurrent production of the aircraft while it was still in development and testing led to expensive design changes and retrofits. The F-35B entered service with the U.S. Marine Corps in July 2015, followed by the U.S. Air Force F-35A in August 2016 and the U.S. Navy F-35C in February 2019. The F-35 was first used in combat in 2018 by the Israeli Air Force, which also shot down the first enemy aircraft in combat, in 2021. The U. S. plans to buy 2,456 F-35s through 2044, which will represent the bulk of the crewed tactical air power of the U.S. Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps for several decades. The aircraft is projected to operate until 2070. The first combat-capable Block 2B configuration, which had basic air-to-air -air and strike capabilities, was declared ready by the USMC in July 2015. The Block 3F configuration began operational test and evaluation, OTAN, in December 2018, the completion of which will conclude SDD. The F-35 program is also conducting sustainment and upgrade development, with early RIP aircraft gradually upgraded to the baseline Block 3F standard by 2021. The F-35 is expected to be continually upgraded over its lifetime. The first upgrade program, called Continuous Capability Development and Delivery, C2D2, began in 2019 and is currently planned to run to 2024. The near-term development priority of C2D2 is Block 4, which would integrate additional weapons, including those unique to international customers, refresh the avionics, improve ESM capabilities, and add remotely operated video enhanced receiver, rover, support. C2D2 also places greater emphasis on agile software development to enable quicker releases. In 2018, the Air Force Life Cycle Management Center, AVL CMC, awarded contracts to General Electric and Pratt and & Whitney to develop more powerful and efficient adaptive cycle engines for potential application in the F-35, leveraging the research done under the Adaptive Engine Transition Program, AETP. In 2022, the F-35 Adaptive Engine Replacement, FAER, program was launched to integrate adaptive cycle engines into the aircraft by 2028. Defense contractors have offered upgrades to the F-35 outside of official program contracts. In 2013, Northrop Grumman disclosed its development of a directional infrared countermeasure suite, named Threat Nullification Defensive Resource, THNDR. The countermeasure system would share the same space as the Distributed Aperture System, DAS, sensors and acts as a laser missile jammer to protect against infrared homing missiles. Israel wants more access to the core avionics to include their own equipment. Stealth is a key aspect of the F-35's design, and radar cross-section, RCS, is minimized through careful shaping of the airframe and the use of radar absorbent materials, RAM. Visible measures to reduce RCS include alignment of edges, serration of skin panels, and the masking of the engine face and turbine. Additionally, the F-35's diverterless supersonic inlet, DSI, uses a compression bump and forward swept cowl rather than a splitter gap or bleed system to divert the boundary layer away from the inlet duct, eliminating the diverter cavity and further reducing radar signature. The RCS of the F-35 has been characterized as lower than a metal golf ball at certain frequencies and angles. In some conditions, the F-35 compares favorably to the F-22 in stealth. For maintainability, the F-35 stealth design took lessons learned from prior stealth aircraft such as the F-22. The F-35's radar-absorbent fiber mat skin is more durable and requires less maintenance than older topcoats. 
The aircraft also has reduced infrared and visual signatures as well as strict controls of radio frequency emitters to prevent their detection. The F-35 stealth design is primarily focused on high-frequency X-band wavelengths. Low-frequency radars can spot stealthy aircraft due to Rayleigh scattering, but such radars are also conspicuous, susceptible to clutter, and lack precision. To disguise its RCS, the aircraft can mount four Lunebork lens reflectors. Noise from the F-35 caused concerns in residential areas near potential bases for the aircraft, and residents near two such bases, Luke Air Force Base, Arizona, and Eglin Air Force Base, AFB, Florida, requested environmental impact studies in 2008 and 2009 respectively. Although the noise level in decibels were comparable to those of prior fighters such as the F-16, the sound power of the F-35 is stronger particularly at lower frequencies. Subsequent surveys and studies have indicated that the noise of the F-35 was not perceptibly different from the F-16 and F-A-18E-F, though the greater low-frequency noise was noticeable for some observers. To preserve its stealth shaping, the F-35 has two internal weapons bays with four weapon stations. The two outboard weapon stations each can carry ordnance up to 2,500 pounds, 1,100 kilograms, or 1,500 pounds, 680 kilograms, for F-35B, while the two inboard stations carry air-to-air -air missiles. Air-to-surface weapons for the outboard station include the Joint Direct Attack Munition, JDAM, Paveway Series of Bombs, Joint Standoff Weapon, JSOW, and Cluster Munitions, Wind Corrected Munitions Dispenser. The station can also carry multiple smaller munitions such as the GBU-39 Small Diameter Bombs, SDB, GBU-53-BSDB-2, and Spear-3 Anti-Tank Missiles. Up to four SDBs can be carried per station for the F-35A and F-35C, and three for the F-35B. The inboard station can carry the AIM-120 MROM. Two compartments behind the weapons bays contain flares, chaff, and towed decoys. The aircraft can use six external weapon stations for missions that do not require stealth. The wingtip pylons each can carry an AIM-9X or AIM-132AS ram and are canted outwards to reduce their radar cross-section. Additionally, each wing has a 5,000 pounds, 2,300 kilograms, inboard station and a 2,500 pounds, 1,100 kilograms, middle station, or 1,500 pounds, 680 kilograms, for F-35B. The external wing stations can carry large air-to-surface weapons that would not fit inside the weapons bays such as the AGM-158 Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missile, JASM, Cruise Missile. An air-to-air -air missile load of 8 AIM-120s and 2 AIM-9s is possible using internal and external weapon stations. A configuration of 6 2,000 pounds, 910 kilograms, bombs, 2 AIM-120s and 2 AIM-9s can also be arranged. The F-35A is armed with a 25mm GAU 22-A rotary cannon mounted internally near the left wing route with 182 rounds carried. The gun is more effective against ground targets than the 20mm cannon carried by other USAF fighters. The F-35B and F-35C have no internal gun and instead can use a Terma AS multi-mission pod, MMP, carrying the GAU 22-A and 220 rounds. The pod is mounted on the centerline of the aircraft and shaped to reduce its radar cross-section. In lieu of the gun, the pod can also be used for different equipment and purposes, such as electronic warfare, aerial reconnaissance, or rear-facing tactical radar. Lockheed Martin is developing a weapon rack called Sidekick that would enable the internal outboard station to carry two AIM-120s, thus increasing the internal air-to-air -air payload to six missiles, currently offered for Block 4. Block 4 will also have a rearranged hydraulic line and bracket to allow the F-35B to carry four SDBs per internal outboard station. Integration of the MBDA Meteor is also planned. The USAF and USN are planning to integrate the AGM-88 GMER internally in the F-35A and F-35C. Norway and Australia are funding an adaptation of the Naval Strike Missile, NSM, for the F-35, designated Joint Strike Missile, JSM, two missiles can be carried internally with an additional four externally. Nuclear weapons delivery via internal carriage of the B-61 nuclear bomb is planned for Block 4B in 2024. Both hypersonic missiles and direct energy weapons such as solid-state laser are currently being considered as future upgrades. Lockheed Martin is studying integrating a fiber laser that uses spectral beam combining multiple individual laser modules into a single high-power beam, which can be scaled to various levels. The USAF plans for the F-35A to take up the Close Air Support, CAS, mission in contested environments, 
Amid criticism that it is not as well suited as a dedicated attack platform, USAF Chief of Staff Mark Welsh placed a focus on weapons for CAS sorties, including guided rockets, fragmentation rockets that shatter into individual projectiles before impact, and more compact ammunition for higher capacity gun pods. Fragmentary rocket warheads create greater effects than cannon shells as each rocket creates a thousand round burst, delivering more projectiles than a strafing run. The F-35 was designed with three initial variants, the F-35A, a tall land-based version, the F-35B, a stovel version capable of use either on land or on aircraft carriers, and the F-35C, a catabar carrier-based version. Since then, there has been work on the design of nationally specific versions for Israel and Canada, as well as initial concept design work for an updated version of the F-35A, which would become the F-35D. The F-35A is the conventional takeoff and landing CTOL, variant intended for the USAF and other air forces. It is the smallest, lightest version and capable of 9 grams, the highest of all variants. Although the F-35A currently conducts aerial refueling via boom and receptacle method, the aircraft can be modified for probe and drogue refueling if needed by the customer. A drag chute pod can be installed on the F-35A, with the Royal Norwegian Air Force being the first operator to adopt it. The F-35B is the short takeoff and vertical landing, stovel, variant of the aircraft, similar in size to the A variant, the B sacrifices about a third of the A variant's fuel volume to accommodate the SDLF. This variant is limited to 7 grams. Unlike other variants, the F-35B has no landing hook. The stovel-slash-hook control instead engages conversion between normal and vertical flight. The F-35B can also perform vertical and or short takeoff and landing, v slash stole. The F-35C variant is designed for catapult-assisted takeoff but arrested recovery operations from aircraft carriers. Compared to the F-35A, the F-35C features larger wings with foldable wingtip sections, larger control surfaces for improved low-speed control, stronger landing gear for the stresses of carrier-arrested landings, a twin-wheel nose gear, and a stronger tailhook for use with carrier arrestor cables. The larger wing area allows for decreased landing speed while increasing both range and payload. The F-35C structure is limited to a positive 7.5 grams compared to 9 grams for the F-35A and 7 grams for the F-35B, though in practice they operate below these limits to preserve airframe life. The F-35I Adir is an F-35A with unique Israeli modifications. The US initially refused to allow such changes before permitting Israel to integrate its own electronic warfare systems, including sensors and countermeasures. The main computer has a plug-and-play function for add-on systems. Proposals include an external jamming pod, and new Israeli air-to-air -air missiles and guided bombs in the internal weapon base. A senior IAF official said that the F-35 stealth may be partly overcome within 10 years despite a 30-40 to 40 year service life, thus Israel's insistence on using their own electronic warfare systems. Israel Aerospace Industries IAI, has considered a two-seat F-35 concept, an IA executive noted. There is a known demand for two seats not only from Israel but from other air forces. IA plans to produce conformal fuel tanks. Data from Lockheed Martin, F-35 specifications, Lockheed Martin, F-35 weaponry, Lockheed Martin, F-35 program status, F-35 program brief, FY 2019 select acquisition report, SAR, Director of Operational Test and Evaluation General Characteristics. Crew, 1. Length, 51.4 feet, 15.7 meters. Wingspan, 35 feet, 11 meters. Height, 14.4 feet, 4.4 meters. Wing area, 460 square feet, 43 square meters. Aspect ratio, 2.66. Empty weight, 29,300 pounds, 13,290 kilograms. Gross weight, 49,540 pounds, 22,471 kilograms. Max takeoff weight, 70,000 pounds, 31,751 kilograms. Fuel capacity, 18,250 pounds, 8,278 kilograms, internal. Power plant, 1 times Pratt & Whitney F-135 PW100 afterburning turbofan, 28,000 lbf, 125 kilonewtons, thrust dry, 43,000 lbf, 191 kilonewtons with afterburner performance maximum speed Mach 1.6 at altitude range 1500 nautical miles 1700 miles 2800 kilometers combat range 
669 nautical miles, 770 miles, 1,239 kilometers, on internal fuel. 760 nautical miles, 870 miles, 1,410 kilometers, interdiction mission on internal fuel, for internal air-to-air -air configuration. Service ceiling, 50,000 feet, 15,000 meters. G limits, plus 9.0. Wing loading, 107.7 pounds per square foot, 526 kilogram slash M2, at gross weight. Thrust slash weight, 0.87 at gross weight, 1.07 at loaded weight with 50% internal fuel armament. Guns, 125 millimeters, 0.984 in, GAU 22 slash A4 barrel rotary cannon, 180 rounds. Hard points, 4 times internal stations. 6 times external stations on wings with a capacity of 5,700 pounds, 2,600 kilograms, internal, 15,000 pounds, 6,800 kilograms, external, 18,000 pounds, 8,200 kilograms, total weapons payload, with provisions to carry combinations of missiles, air-to-air -air missiles, AIM-120 AMROM, AIM-9X Sidewinder, AIM-132 AS RAM, MBDA Meteor, Block 4, for F-35B, not before 2027. Air-to-surface missiles. AGM-88 GMER, Block 4. AGM-158 JASM. Spear 3, Block 4, in development, integration contracted. Joint air-to-ground missile, JAGM. Air-to-surface-slash-anti-ship missiles. Joint strike missile, JSM, integration in progress. Anti-ship missiles. AGM-158 SEALRASM, being integrated. Bombs, Joint Direct Attack Munition, JDAM, Series. Paveway Series Laser Guided Bombs. AGM-154 JSO, B-61 Mod-12 Nuclear Bomb, being certified avionics. and slash APG-81 ESA Radar. and slash OC-40 EO Targeting System, EOTS and slash OC-37 Distributed Aperture System, DAS, Missile Warning System, and slash ASQ-239 Barracuda Electronic Warfare System, and slash ASQ-242 CNI Suite, which includes Harris Corporation Multifunction Advanced Data Link, MADL, Communication System, AM, VHF, UHF AM, and UHF FM Radio, Guard Survival Radio, a Radar Altimeter, an instrument landing system, attack and system, instrument carrier landing system, a JPLS, Tadil JJVMF slash VMF. If you are going up against near peer rivals, the F-35 is definitely worth its cost, but for bombing insurgents, not so much. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, share, comment and subscribe. Thank you.